We are here at BKTEL Photonics, an EPIC member company, and we could be talking about the amplifiers over here or over here, but what we really want to focus, because it's absolutely exclusive and special, is this high-power O-band solution that they have, fiber-based. Eric, can you tell us a little bit more about it? Why is it so special? This is very special because it's the first time we have an amplifier based on silica fiber that is uh, fitting with the telecom requirement. So the fact that it's fiber-based makes it easy for the telecom guys to adopt? Yeah, in fact, it's, uh, it's uh, really fitting with uh, exigencies in terms of uh, mechanical uh, uh, robustness, in terms of uh, power consumption. Many all the features are with telecom. This is very important because it, it's for 30 years that we are looking for this kind of so solution. So for 30 years they've been looking for that, but you yeah, found exactly. now a solution that frankly can be adopted by the telecom industry. Uh, now, in terms of performance, uh, how do you, how, how is it going? Well, it's typically you can use as a, a, a classical uh, amplifier for telecom, except that it's in the O band. So you know the O band is the original band, <laughs> is the first uh, optical band for telecom. And, uh, but we never found any amplifier solution for this band. And it's the first time that we have something that is working. What is it that allowed the breakthrough to finally get a solution? You've been working for this for a couple uh, of years, but there has be, been... I will be very honest with you. It's, uh, thanks to our, uh, our uh, partner that is making uh, the specific fiber. Now we know that it's working. And I know that there is a lot of group now they are working on this, this wood type fiber. I do appreciate you mentioned the topic of collaboration because at Epic, you know, we have 800 members. What we want to do is that they work together to achieve these new solutions. You know because Epic drives the photonics revolutions and we're very glad of BKTL Photonics being part of it.